Once the Silka program is opened, select Options to set up the software. We'll go to Settings and then Options again. Under General, you see Measurement Unit. Make sure it's set to 1007 inch. Under Language, you can set the software to any language that you prefer, be it French or Spanish or English. Comparative shows all of the different key manufacturers that will show up in the selection categories. Under Reference Key Manufacturer, make sure it's set to ILCO. Next, go to Preferences Standard Key. Make sure the three boxes, Cutting Check, Check Installed Key, Use Any Clamp for Symmetrical Keys are checked. Once you've checked those boxes, select Save to save your selections. The cutting check function is used to ensure that the maker's or maximum adjacent cut rule is not violated when the user inputs direct cuts, meaning that the user does not put a deep cut next to a shallow cut that could wipe out the shallow cut. The check installed key function is used to ensure that the key is loaded properly in the jaw when cutting symmetrical keys. The Use Any Clamp feature allows the user to select the best jaw position to use when cutting two-sided symmetrical keys. In most cases, you'll want to use jaw position C or D and clamp these keys using the milling groove in the key blade as a guide to ensure the key is gripped straight in the clamp. Preferences Dimple Track Key. Make sure that the Use Mobile Tracer box is checked and then save your data.